Okay, so in our earlier lecture, if you remember this URL, we forked this sample Java project in our GitHub space. Now we'll clone this project to create a local Git repository in our local machine. Let's show you how to do it. So we'll click on this button in order to copy the URL to the clipboard. So as you can see, the tooltip says copy to clipboard. So let's click on it and copy the URL. We'll be requiring this URL very soon in this lecture. Okay, so now I'm in the bash terminal. Let's see where we are. So we are in the user home directory. Now we'll change to git fast. And we are in the git fast directory. Let's clear the screen. Now we'll use the git clone command to clone the repository that we earlier fought off on GitHub. So for this purpose, we will use a git clone command and we'll simply copy paste the URL that I already showed you. Let's press enter. And it's great that the cloning has been done successfully. So let's check it out. So if you do ls minus l listing of the directories in this particular directory git fast, you can see that the sample Java project is right out there. So let's cd into the sample Java project. I press tab again for auto completion. And here we go. Now notice this is very important. And here is a master branch. Branch is nothing but a separate line of development. So let's clear the screen and let's check the contents of the sample Java project directory. Let's do a ls dash al. And here you can see the presence of the dot git directory. This means that this is a git repository, the name of which is sample Java project. And here are the rest of the artifacts of the project. So in this lecture, we have explained you what a fork is. Then we demonstrated how to fork a GitHub project. And subsequently, we cloned a fork project on the GitHub to our local repository.